Magic Mushrooms for Self-Improvement Magic mushrooms can be used as tools for self-improvement, self-enhancement, and a greater degree of openness. Psychedelics for the betterment of well people isn't a new notion, but recent legislation is giving the idea new life. While psilocybin mushrooms are well known for their powerful psychedelic effects, there is far more to these magical mushrooms than many may think. In fact, more and more scientific studies are shedding light on the various incredible life-altering mental and physical health benefits of magic mushrooms. For managing mental health conditions like depression and anxiety, aiding in the maintenance of several forms of addiction, supporting an array of health issues, enhancing creativity, eliciting deep spiritual journeys, and increasing productivity to improving overall mood and well-being, to mention just a few, researchers are finally acknowledging and highlighting the potentially far-reaching benefits of psilocybin mushrooms. And it is about time. The array of negative stigmas surrounding magic mushrooms has been well and truly shattered. This is in large part due to psilocybin mushrooms emerging as a groundbreaking therapy tool for the treatment and management of various chronic ailments, from alleviating symptoms of post-traumatic stress disorder, PTSD, and obsessive-compulsive disorder, OCD, to the management of addiction and addictive behaviors, and several mental health conditions such as depression and anxiety. In fact, psilocybin therapy was recently given Breakthrough Therapy Designation, a review fast track, by the FDA for the treatment of depression. To step it up another notch, as mental health is such a vital component of any individual's overall health and well-being, new research and scientific studies are continuously being conducted on psilocybin mushrooms and its ability to manage and treat various mental health conditions effectively. This means that in addition to the already promising studies and results, there may be even more incredible breakthroughs on the horizon and thus a very bright future ahead with regards to mental health and magic mushrooms. In addition to the remarkable range of physical and mental health benefits of psilocybin mushrooms, magic mushrooms have the potential to take you on a powerful, profound, and enriching journey of self-discovery, self-development, self-improvement, and self-enhancement that is far beyond your wildest dreams and anything you can imagine. You therefore don't need to be dealing with any mental or physical ailments to reap the remarkable benefits of psychedelics and magic mushrooms. In fact, in the 1990s, researcher Bob Jesse articulated the notion that psychedelics could be used for the betterment of well people, aka the self-improvement, self-development, and self-enhancement of people who may not be suffering from any mental and or physical condition, but seek something more profound, enriching, and life-altering out of their psychedelic experience. This notion was further supported in a study conducted by researchers Catherine McLean, Matthew Johnson, and Roland Griffiths, who looked at the effects of psilocybin on healthy, hallucinogen-naive participants, i.e. people who had never tried psychedelics before. The study revealed significant increases in the openness personality trait in the group of participants who had complete mystical experiences during their high-dose psilocybin sessions. In reference to the study, the term openness refers to being permeable to new ideas and experiences and being motivated to enlarge one's experience into novel territory. The trait is also associated with a greater degree of creativity and fluid, flexible thinking. In addition, the researchers defined the term complete mystical experience as an experience characterized by sufficiently intense feeling of unity, transcendence of time and space, ineffability and paradoxicality, scaredness, noetic quality, and positive mood, as measured by participants' responses to the administered States of Consciousness questionnaire. The above research went on to indicate that the participants' increase in openness remained significantly higher than baseline more than one year after the high-dose psilocybin sessions were administered. According to researchers Catherine McLean, Matthew Johnson, and Roland Griffiths, this was the first time that research has effectively demonstrated real changes in personality in healthy adults after an experimentally manipulated discrete event. These findings are not only remarkable and profound, 
but may well represent a progressive and important development in Western society's relationship with psychedelics, as well as self-improvement and self-enhancement as a whole. Magic Mushrooms and its link to self-improvement and enhancement. When it comes down to it, the simple truth is, psychedelics and magic mushrooms can be everything and anything to everyone and anyone. They can be intoxicating, they can give you mind-blowing visuals, they can aid in the treatment and management of several mental and physical health conditions, or they can take you on a spiritual journey that's enriching, remarkably profound, and completely transformational, essentially changing your life, and in turn, your perspective and outlook on life forever. It all depends on you. However, one thing's for sure. If you want a psychedelic experience and journey that goes beyond mere recreation, you need to approach magic mushrooms with a clear focus, intent, and the right preparation. Beyond the intoxication, geometric shapes, and synthesia exists endless potential and a treasure trove of possibilities just waiting to be discovered. All of which you can miss out on if you don't take them more seriously. Throughout history, billions of people have tried, tested, and engaged in various activities and methods to change and improve themselves for the better. From rigorous fitness programs and diet regimens to enhance their physical appearance, to meditative or contemplative practices to become more mindful, centered, compassionate, and grounded. However, the primary issue or problem with most of these traditional means of self-improvement so many of us rely on is the fact that they require long-term commitment and must be practiced consistently, if not daily, for an extended period of time in order to have any effect or produce some sort of beneficial results. Or, in the case of a psychoactive substance, one must be acutely under the influence in order to experience its benefits. In other words, most of these tools do not create change by initiating a single discrete event, but instead require ongoing maintenance and repetition over a period of time, with each use, effort, and engagement creating transient rather than lasting changes. However, the research conducted by Catherine McLean, Matthew Johnson, and Roland Griffiths suggests that psilocybin, when administered within an appropriately structured, supportive, and guided environment and context, could be used to initiate a single discrete event, aka the complete mystical experience, which produces an enduring and long-lasting change in personality and increase in openness. This, in and of itself, signifies an incredible and potentially highly impactful means of human enhancement, or simply enhancement as a whole. Self-enhancement, or enhancement in general, is in turn linked to self-improvement and development and geared towards helping healthy individuals battering themselves and ultimately reaching their full potential. How can magic mushrooms transform you? Magic mushrooms are essentially catalysts that can initiate changes in our personality. As mentioned above, research has shown that the profound effects of psilocybin mushrooms can potentially last for more than six months after a psychedelic trip on a substantial dose. One of the many ways in which magic mushrooms can transform you is its ability to take and guide you through an emotional cathartic release, ultimately helping you get more in touch with your subconscious. In the process, these magical psychedelics dissolve your ego, enabling you to break free from your cycle of rigid thoughts, beliefs, and habits that ultimately hold you back in life. This process is referred to as ego death. A person's ego can be thought of as the culmination of three different components of the human psyche according to the perspective of modern psychologists. These three components include self-image, self-esteem, and self-identity. The culmination of these three components of the human psyche embodies our sense of self, which ultimately helps us quantify and classify our own reality. This in turn affects our beliefs and thoughts, both in memory and in the moment. The ego can therefore be thought of as the gatekeeper of one's consciousness, only admitting into awareness the thoughts and beliefs that align with and confirm to our own self-image, essentially disregarding everything else. When it comes to ego death, it can be defined in several ways, based on varying perspectives. From a philosophical point of view, ego death can be described as a temporary transformation of the psyche. It is effectively the process of shifting from a self-centered perspective trapped in the confines of your own self-limiting beliefs, to being completely unbiased and in a content state of open-mindedness. 
This transformational process has the potential to foster a renewed and novel perspective, completely unclouded by the lens of duality that the ego casts over our consciousness and sense of self. From a scientific standpoint, as opposed to the philosophical point of view, ego death is hypothesized to be the result of dampened activity in the default mode network. This temporary silencing and dampened activity of the DMN essentially acts as a reset or rewiring of the network, as well as the consequent rewiring of your thought patterns, which are otherwise hindered by your ego. This sentiment is echoed by psychologist Dr. Matthew Brown, in which he states, if you do the same thing repeatedly, it is like you are walking down the same path all the time. Brown goes on to say that by dampening the activity in the default mode network, effectively resetting and rewiring the network, ultimately resulting in ego death, you are essentially mowing the lawn and clearing the way so that you can stroll down the new path you've created a bit more easily. Besides a profound change in perspective, ego death can bring about some truly remarkable and potentially life-altering experiences and benefits, including an increase in traits like openness and empathy. In addition, ego death gives you the unique opportunity to experience a true, authentic, and completely unbiased reality. A reality that is entirely free of any self-limiting beliefs or thought patterns that, in many cases, have been so deeply ingrained in us. Ego death can therefore be seen as an eye-opening reflection, illustration, or glimpse into the various ways in which our egos have lied to us in order to preserve our own self-image, self-identity, and self-esteem. The benefits don't end there. Incredible experiences of spiritual awakening, as well as drastic shifts in personality can be brought about by the brief amalgamation of self and other as it serves to grant us the realization that we are all connected. In fact, this profound feeling of connectedness and notion of oneness is one of the top criteria used by psychedelic scientists to qualify the mystical experience, which directly correlates to higher rates of healing experienced by individuals using psychedelics for conditions like depression, anxiety, and addiction. Tripping on Magic Mushrooms with Intent Every journey begins with the first step of articulating your intention, and then becoming the intention. Tripping with the intent is the ultimate differentiating factor. The only way you will truly gain any sense of self-improvement, self-enhancement, and self-development, aka something more and profound, out of your magic mushroom experience is to trip with intent. Casual trippers, those consuming magic mushrooms with no clear or set intent, miss out on all the remarkable and potentially life-altering effects and benefits that magic mushrooms and psychedelics have to offer, including the profound transformative impact it can have on their lives. This results in recreational users not enjoying and relishing in the full potential of their trip or reaping the maximum benefits of their psychedelic mushroom experience and journey. To back this up, Myron Stolaroff a researcher and author best known for his work in psychedelic psychotherapy, stated the following about psychedelics. Their true purpose is to enhance growth and interior development. Used only for pleasure or abused, the inner self is thwarted, which leads to unpleasant experiences and depression. Myron Stolaroff goes on to say that when preparing and embarking on a psychedelic magic mushroom journey, you should approach it in the same manner as you would any other journey to reap the greatest rewards. First off, have intent and purpose. Establish a plan of action. Have an itinerary and plan of where you want to go, areas you want to discover and delve deeper into, and questions you want to explore during your trip. It should be thought of as a therapeutic session that should not be taken lightly. An honest appraisal about yourself. If you are tripping in a group setting, Set time aside where you can be by yourself in order to do some quiet introspection and set an intent and purpose for your psychedelic journey. A great way to set yourself up for an introspective and intentional magic mushroom experience is to ask yourself more in-depth and profound questions regarding your life, such as, what prevents me and holds me back from reaching my full potential? Does my behavior and daily actions complement my personal goals and beliefs? Why do I let my self-limiting beliefs and self-sabotaging actions have such a monumental impact on my life? 
and what I want to achieve. What changes do I need to make and what actions do I need to take to make my life better? These are merely a few examples of questions you can ask yourself, all of which can have a big impact on your overall journey. It is extremely important to take the necessary time to think about each question, feel it, and reflect deeply upon it. If you focus your mind on these specific questions and intentions during your trip, you will undoubtedly come back from your psychedelic experience and journey fully enriched and transformed, having learned extraordinary things about yourself and your life. How to Use Your Magic Mushroom Trip for Self-Improvement the pioneer of the use of psychedelic therapy, Leo Zeff, put it best by saying the quality of a trip is not determined by your experience that day, but by your subsequent growth in the following months. Magic mushroom users tend to focus solely on individual psychedelic trips, isolating each magic mushroom experience, never connecting one trip to the other, or viewing their psychedelic journeys as part of an interconnecting bigger picture. They choose to view them as separate and exclusive rather than in its entirety. This is the biggest issue and roadblock to using your magic mushroom trip for self-improvement and enhancement. By being intentional, focused, and paying attention to every insight you encounter during your magic mushroom experience and trip, and commit to applying these newfound lessons, perceptions, and perspectives into your daily life, your psychedelic experiences will exceed all your expectations and Instead of simply being an intoxicating high with mind-blowing visuals, they will become profound and impactful events that not only catalyzes change in various aspects of your life, but helps you reach your highest level of self-awareness, self-improvement, self-development, and self-enhancement. One of the best ways to measure the impact and quality of your trip is to consider how much you've gained and grown from it. As you embark on a number of magic mushroom psychedelic trips, each new lesson you learn perspective you acquire, and insight you gain from the experience can provide you with important and essential feedback, awareness, and understanding about yourself, your life, and any issues and struggles you may be facing, thereby helping you face and come to term with them, dissect them, and ultimately deal with them one at a time, essentially eliminating any possible issues, areas of concern, and self-limiting beliefs that can not only contribute to a potentially bad trip, but prevent you from experiencing the complete, liberating psychedelic journey in its entirety, as well as hold you back from reaching your full potential and achieving self-improvement, development, and enhancement. Once you've experienced the benefits of tripping with intent, you will come to realize how much more fulfilling it is when you trip with the intention of self-improvement. Plus, your life may change for the better in so many unbelievable ways.